Hey, what's going on? Butch from Butch Terrio here. I'm going to do a one week read for Capricorn. And uh, it won't resonate with everybody because it is a general read. Um, first and foremost, I'd like to say Happy Thanksgiving to all of you out there. Um, it's Thanksgiving in Canada anyway. Um, and if you haven't already, don't feel, don't forget to like and subscribe. Always feel free to comment down below. And if you need any, any more information, um, feel free to go to my YouTube description. And uh, yeah, so let's get right into it. So what we have for the Capricorns. Anyways, what do we have for Capricorns? What's coming up for Capricorns? What's good for the Capricorns? What can we tell them? What can we show them? What is out there? All right. Well, what I, from what I see, first off, it's a three of wands. So I feel like you've kind of been waiting on something. You kind of made, you know, um, you made an offer. Um, and now you're just kind of waiting, you know, to see how that plays out. But I feel like, I feel like while you're waiting, you're just really, you know, it's, it's bugging you that this person hasn't, you know, come come to you yet um, hasn't reciprocated your offer or even gave you any kind of indication of what was going on um, and I feel like we got the hermit so I feel like you've been kind of really like really in your head and you're having a hard time sleeping because you're just not sure you know if you made the right you know the right call in making this offer and I feel like you have some you know you, you think that I got the I feel like you think that they're leaving you out in the cold, like you know they're they're just kind of ghosting you right now, um, and I, and like also the the page of cups, I feel like they're just weighing the option. I feel like they're they're not they're not quite ready to say one way or the other. They're weighing the option. Um, I got you know I I I, I feel like. I feel like they're just kind of dealing with something right now, and the only reason they're weighing the option is because they're not sure if they're ready for a new commitment. Um, I I feel like they just recently with the death card. I, I really I'm getting the feeling that they just kind of had something had something you know that came to an end, and they're just kind of weighing whether or not they're ready for a new opportunity. Um, you know, I do see they do see they do hold you in the highest regard. I do see they see you as very, you know, they're very attracted to you. Um, they do want to move forward with you, but they're just not sure if they're ready right now. Um, you know, I feel like they're just trying to get, trying to get their head in order and trying to, you know, figure out what's the best move for them right now coming for going forward. Um, so I feel like, I feel like, you know, you made the right call making this offer. I feel like they're really thinking about it. And I don't feel like they're going to leave you out in the cold. I feel like they are going to come around. They're just not sure right now. Like, like I said, maybe they're just, you know, I'm getting the feeling that they're just kind of letting this old relationship or this old feelings they have for somebody else just kind of, um, you know, be at peace. You know, give themselves some uh, some clearance from from this whole thing they don't want to bring their old baggage into you into your relationship with them, you know they don't want to jump into a relationship with you and and bring in that this old negative vibes that they have from this past relationship i feel like the old relationship really did a number on them and i feel like they're just kind of you know like i said they're just they don't want to bring any bad stuff in with to you they don't want to bring any um any negative vibes um but I feel like they are going to come around. 
um, because I do have the Sun card. So I feel like it's all going to work out. And I also got the Ten of Pentacles. So I feel like, you know, what you want is going to happen. I feel like you're just going to be patient. you got to con continue to wait, um, the Three of Wands. I feel like you, you just need to continue to wait and just kind of, you know, remember that, like, the, the Hunter Moon just, it was out last night. And, you know, it it's starting something new. So, you know, I feel like in the next week you'll, you will hear back from them. And, you know, it, this will all be kind of really clear. And, you know, they'll just let you know that they, they do want to move forward with you. Um, I feel like they just don't want to tell you, you know, about this past. But like I said, I don't, I don't feel like they're leaving you out in the cold. Like, I feel like they're not ghosting you because, you know, they don't want anything to do with you. They're just not talking to you right now because they're not, sh they're not answering you right now because they're not sure of how to move forward. Um, but I do feel like they are going to come around, you know, I do feel with the Emperor card, they're going to get on top of, uh, uh, of their emotions and they're going to figure out, you know, that how to move forward with you. They do want to move forward with you. I mean, the Sun card is telling me that and also the Ten of Pentacles, um, you know, they do want to have a relationship with you. They're just not, you know, they're not, they're not at the place right now where they're ready to answer. But I feel like they will be very shortly. But like I said, they, they do look at you like they have a lot of respect and, and they do have a lot of feelings for you. Um, and this is why they're doing it this way. Um, they want to be sure and precise before they make that move. Um, and the King of Cups, like, I got the King of Cups in reverse. So I feel like, yeah, like that's what I'm, they're just not ready to give all their emotions to you. So they're not going to make a move right away. Um... They're just trying to get on top of it, but they will. Um, you know, like I said, the past has been complicated for them, and they're just trying to, you know, break, like, like they got, because I got the death card, so they're just kind of waiting for that all to come to an end. And I feel like it's going to, in the next week, they're going to come, they're going to get back to you, and I feel like they're going to come forward with some information that's going to let you know how this has all been working out. Um, you know, I don't feel like, I don't, I don't feel like there's anything here that's showing me that, you know, there's any, there's any possibility that they're playing you or they're, they're actually trying to hurt you. Uh, I see the opposite. I see the fact that they're just trying to make sure that they don't come to you. They want to come to you with their ducks in a row, if that makes any sense. Um, so my advice is just, just be patient. Um, good things to come to those who wait. Um, be patient. They are coming. And, um... Yeah, like I said, they they do they do they do respect you. I got the sun card, so I see that you know a lot of positive it positive, and I got the ten of pentacles. So I mean, I feel like everything you want is about to happen. You just gotta be patient. This person is just working on some old issues. Um, they're coming to you with a fresh you know a fresh fresh plate. So that's what I got for you, Capricorns. Um, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Happy Thanksgiving, and I'll see you soon.